Knowing his matchup, of course, Xie can look towards an assassin if he chooses. And having the ability to, if he wants as well, go the Doin B route with itemization and go for the Abyssal Mask now that he's against. So the first tree is very standard. I was wondering what second tree is from a lot of these guys. Melon, in with the flash, Arsic Assault, Icon's gonna get slowed and oh, stunned down as well. World 6, just a little too late to the party. And supporting. That top lane gank felt very awkward as here uh -oh. they go. Cheese it, Icon. I don't think he's making it out alive on this. Oh! oh! No, he's Actually, still very close. No, 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 that's not the one. That's not. <laughs> that's not where you want to go. Icon chose the wrong direction. Of all the places he. Towards a dragon at this point, but it's ocean, so neither team super aggro on it. Well, 60 discovered another lane. And he's, he's actually not going to go in this because fight. they've gone a little too early. And now there's going to be actually a kill on top of the Shen. Spat back out. Perfect timing. But five. I don't know what that flash was about because he instantly goes down to Mystic. In comes the throw. Well, six again with his OMG. Bring World Six down, and then walk away and lose a two v three. Flag drag knocks up the melon, and he's locked in place. Chelly comes out for the kill on melon. Too long in enemy territory. The bot lane was already gone. It is fantastic. He's excited every time someone comes near it. True. Flag drag got the torn down on top of Ben as well, but in comes WE to try and salvage the situation or do more than that. Almost a kill down to World Six. Melon, he's low. He could be another casualty, but it will be a one for one trade on the junglers. Didn't even catch how World Six died. Yes, Shia on the backside is actually just locking him down before he can actually engage on top of Mystic. Oh, now they while want While was down, gonna shoot out the Tam Kench onto the jungle, <laughs> and World Six try to crawl away with the Cataclysm. It's just so much from Callista too. I mean, OMG, they've got to get in there right now. They know it's happening, but they didn't particularly beeline it towards the Baron. Callista gets a free rend, and now they turn on to OMG as well. Great knockout from World 6, but the jungler flashes away. Meanwhile, World 6 has got a bunch of rend stacks in him. Chelly goes down to Shie, who's just bobbing and weaving through the fight. He's going to get another kill Presence onto World 6. On. And now it's Kassadin time, ladies and gentlemen. Five getting caught out as well. There's the triple kill. Icon under the tower. Make it the quadra kill. Easy four kills for the mid laner of Team WE. Now he's going to tick over to 16. Everything just goes such a second time. Exactly. And now the mid tower will be falling to WE. And this looks a whole lot like last game. As where did the AD carry go? Chelly falls, as does World 6. Mid inhibitor about to fall on top of that. And I think WE might just win the game right yeah, here. They're just going to keep on pushing down the middle lane. OMG have to try and clear the wave, but it's very hard to do. Mystic, he wants to end. Melon, he's leading the charge, and that was a big force pulse. First kill goes over to Mystic, second one as well, and Xiang, last one on the spawn pad, gets all of his health back via Hemo Plague, but his entire team, unfortunately, he can't get that one back. Second Nexus turret falls, and Mystic, he's going in. Go on, tank the Nexus turret for me, Ben. Get in there, I want this final kill. Nexus will fall, and Team WE, a 2 and 0 dominant win over OMG. And Dominant is the way to describe this set, Pulse. At no moment did it look like Team WE were going to lose. OMG, absolute control of nothing in that set. Not even a single moment did it feel like OMG had something. They got a kill, and then they would get another single kill. WE would take the objective and everything they earned. Very clean stuff for the first set of Team WE in 2018. Well, and uh, I want to say World 6. And well, uh, WE will just marching over, get those handshakes, and take the well-deserved bow in just a second because that's d the WE we wanted to see, essentially. They didn't have to try very hard for it, which is my only qualm <laughs> about this set, but I mean, hey, if the gameplay is as tight as that and we see Conley come back into the team as well, we'll see what they look like yeah. further down the line against some of the other top teams. They did all of that with the fruit in the jungle as well, so it's very impressive stuff from this side and a well-deserved bow for Melon in particular.